Well, that one's coming. Hello, welcome to Pursuit of Perfect System. And my name's Terry Ellis. I nearly forgot my name there. My name's Terry Ellis. I'm an audio reviewer and direct life calibrator. In this video, we're doing a song demonstration as part of the review for the Bowers & Wilkins 603 speakers. And obviously, the brand new speakers out from Bowers & Wilkins. If you want to know more about the system that we're recording, how we do it, why we do it and why it works, check out the very first video I made for the song demonstration series, which will be linked up there. There's been two so far, and this is number three. Now, in this song demonstration, I'm going to use an audio file classic because I've used different types of music so far. This is an absolute audio file classic. Everybody owns this. Every audio file, sorry, owns this album. Uh, Ambison, September from Montreal. The album's called Blue Mind, sorry. September from Montreal was the song. Everybody's got it. Everybody's heard it to death. So it's a fantastic track to compare, really. Listen to how it sounds on these speakers compared to how you, you think it should sound, or how you, you know, kind of your own expectation. I think you'd be bloody surprised and really impressed. Obviously, the system we've got at the moment is fantastic. We've got a lot of fantastic products in here, and I've gone through all those already. So yeah, let me press play. I hope you enjoy, and I'll come back and talk to you after. And what I should say is actually I apologize to Nintronics actually, because I need to thank them for loaning me this sample for review. It's really important. So thank you to the guys at Nintronics. If you're interested in buying the speakers, I would suggest speaking to them because you get absolutely fantastic service from them. And that obviously makes a huge difference. So right, hope you enjoy this song. I'll come back and talk to you after. Smile and soft Walking in the evening sunset My thoughts are floating by In this all shopping sky A blessing that we all do share today Cause you are my man That's where as you 
home. What do you think? Very sultry, seductive song, isn't it? Really engaging though, when the bits come in, the dynamic parts come in, really kind of changes tempo, changes pace, changes scale, doesn't it? Really, and the most impressive thing about that track, and the reason I used it actually, is because the continuum bass, mid bass driver, sorry, the continuum mid range driver, even from Bowers and Wilkins, is absolutely fantastic. When I reviewed the 705 S2s, I was really impressed by kind of the clean and, and clarity of the sound overall, really, from those speakers. But that mid range driver, that mid range driver, is really fantastic. It really works. And what 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 I mean by that, if I can spit the words out. It means you just get a really focused and clean and clear mid-range. Even with having the speakers towed out as much as they are, which helped with the sound stage width for the sound, which is why I did it, I was still able to get a very clean and clear and focused and tight and quite full mid-range and vocal, which is really, really, really important as part of the presentation for it to be believable. You need to have a solid center image, as we all know. But sometimes, obviously, you need to kind of tow speakers in in order to achieve that. But with the Bowers and Wilkins, you really don't. You can get away with having them towed out, and you still get a lovely central image, which actually gives the overall soundstage a lot of space, especially in a smaller room like what we're in at the moment. And I think that's really important for a lot of people to pay attention to at home, that aspect of the performance, because a lot of people listen in smaller rooms, especially in the UK, maybe in, in our countries, in America, whatever, you've got bigger rooms. But, you know, this British company, I think the speakers are designed with British-sized rooms in mind especially from a base output point of view, which I'll talk about much more when it comes to the review time. But I just think they work really well in a, in a smaller room where you've not got huge amounts of space, but you're able, you know, a lot of people tow their speakers out, I think, to try and give the sound as much width as possible and as much space between left and right to allow stuff to form. And that, that's exactly what you get. It forms lovely, you get a lovely set of sound stage across the middle between the speakers and a nice amount of width outside the speakers as well. But we don't lose lovely focus mid-range and clarity, which is what I was trying to say, a long-winded way of saying that. Oh, I've been very impressed with the Bowers and Wilkins. I hope you like that song, and I hope that gets across really some of the strengths of the Bowers and Wilkins. As I say, mid-range clarity, very, very strong for this price point, very strong. Right, so there's gonna be one more song demonstration, something completely different, and come back for that. Make sure you go and visit our website if you haven't already. Make sure you go and see the very first video I made for the Bowser Wilkins speaker review, which gives them an introduction. If you haven't seen that one, I'll link that one up there. There's loads of great content in our, in our YouTube channel. And there's some seriously good stuff on its way, all getting lined up for the very near future. So if you haven't subscribed, make sure you do. Click the notification bell, ding. I haven't got a sound effect, so I'll make one, ding. So that when I get a new, when I create a new video, you get a little nudge and it pops up to tell you that it's, it's available. I'll make a lot of videos. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. Take care, thanks for watching.